Ooh, they were lucky that wasn't turned over. Anthony Edwards, that time he does finish with the exclamation point. In, in towns and maybe even double up the post. Towns puts a move on the game. And oh. put it down. See, that's what makes me want to play. It's those. McDonald's All-American, and guess who won the Mr. Basketball Award his year? Oh, Carl Anthony Towns is Mr. Basketball in the NBA tonight. Yes, he is. Jones to Butler to Towns. Oh, oh, oh don't look oh. at him. Don't oh. look at him like that. Oh, oh, I see you. What's up, YouTube? Back with another video, and today we have episode 11 of Win With Every Team, which is a play now online series where I get a win with every team, and on top of that, I use that team's playbook. And today we got the Timberwolves, so you'll see possessions of me using a few plays in their playbook. I made a Timberwolves playbook video earlier this week, so if you want to check that out, I'll leave that linked in the description, and I'll put a card on the top right of the screen as well. And this team is pretty nice. Cat, you know, he's a beast. He gets buckets in the post, and he can shoot it, plays defense, gets rebounds. D'Angelo Russell, he could dribble and shoot. So the pick and roll and pick and fade game with D'Lo and Cat is pretty effective. Anthony Edwards, he could hit threes and he dunks on people, but he's kind of slow with the ball. So like getting him towards the rim can be hard. But I was running this play, give 41 circle, which is probably the best backdoor cutting play to get lobs that I've used this year so far. And I was able to get him a lot of lobs using that play. And you also have other guys like Patrick Beverly. He could hit an open three, play defense. Malik Beasley could shoot as well. Well, the bench really isn't all that good, but I still like this team and I recommend giving them a try. So as always, I hope you enjoyed the video. Thanks for watching and stay tuned for more content. It's deflected. Body block. Beverly outside. And here's Edwards outside. Here's Towns. Second chance shot. Out to Beverly. From downtown. Thank you, Towns. Thank you for saving the day. His shot selection has really improved. He's much more choosy on when he shoots. Get out the paint, dude. Back to Towns. Over Vucevic. Towns gets the bucket. Well, just tremendous persistence from Carl Anthony Towns. Even under duress, the ability to stay focused. You know, while Levine is picking up his spots a bit more, he is still the guy for this team late in games. He really is. I mean, he can create a shot for himself any trip down the floor. He's been the de facto leader for a while for this Bulls club, and nobody else has as much experience on late game shots. Here's DeRozan. McDaniels with the rebound. And the lead. Kobe White. Side Russell. And here's Edwards. Puts up a three. No, just been something to watch. Pass to Prince. The three is up. And that's good. His first bucket of the game. It's hard to make your way in today's NBA without being a tremendous three-point shooter. Torian Prince doing work from beyond the arc. All right, let's get a report from Ali. Thanks, Brian. Well, Zach Levine with his first All-Star selection in 2021, and then the Bulls added a second All-Star, Nikola Vucevic, at the trade deadline. Levine said, we got another big-time yeah, player here. So Guys, with this combination, they have a chance to be special. Well, they're putting some pieces together, Allie. Thanks for that. And defying the analytics trend, DeRozan's favorite shot still remains the mid-range jumper. I mean, they've tried this. Here's Towns. It was at this moment he knew. He fucked up. Oh. Second option 
is taken away because at that point every defense takes away. Look at him. He reached and got burned. Again. Jones misses. And here's Minnesota. Look at him reaching. They're on a 12 to 4 run. Towns for three to the paint. Kobe. And again, it's Minnesota converting. And here's Edwards. Six points for him. Pass to Beverly. Throws it up high. <laughs> nah, this and play is so good. On a crazy offensive. Zach Levine working that mid range game. So easy, so fluid. Oh, I just made it early. This game is fake. Boy, the form is beautiful from distance for Zach Levine. The elbow position, the follow through, the snap of the wrist, it's all there. Pass to McDaniels. There's the triple. Knocks down the triple. Outside Russell. And there's the lob. That's the big cat, so fluid at the center position. Good chance here for Vucevic. Again, the full score. Yeah, he has a really nice feel from that spot, and the size gives him a clear advantage. Well, sometimes when you've got size, your release point is so high that you're going to get a good look. Good shot, cat. Knocks down the long. Outside Russell. Tries to spin. Oh, and there's the whistle. Shot clock at six. Here's Towns. That one's good. Seven for ten now. I mean, there's no aspect of the offensive end of the floor that's problematic for Towns. He's a three-level scorer. His team understands he's in rhythm. It's looking easy for him right now. That's one of those clutch shots he's known for. When the pressure is high, he seems to be the most locked in. To the inside. Towns. And it's Towns with the power finish. Well, the more repetition he gets, the more floor awareness you develop. D'Angelo Russell showing a desire to get his teammates involved. Pick by Vucevic. To the middle. Stupid, I'm not gonna let you get the chance. Careening off the glass. Left side Edwards. Give me my aunt. From beyond the arc in a big way. Three. I'll tell you, it takes confidence to pull the trigger in that situation. You love guys who embellish the moment. Here's Towns. Oh, he nails it. If Carl Anthony Towns carves space and is in the painted area, it's going to go in the basket. He's that good. Takes a step back. Let's go. And there's the foul. It's on Zach Levine. Here's Levine. That one's good. The team doing what it can to get the ball into Levine's hands. You see why. Look ahead to your busy week. Sit down. Relax. Pull up a chair. As we bring you another NBA broadcast. And thanks for sharing part of your weekend with us. Gold Town. This is Kevin Harlan, and by my side, Greg Anthony and Brent Beer. And from the sideline to the paint. Here's Edwards. Huh. And Edwards with the stop. Randall in the paint. Coach said he's always been a great finisher, and we have to respect that. So we can't let him get comfortable down there. It's a big task when Randall gets himself going. Guys? Thank you, David. Yeah, that's what we call playing with force in Towns going up for the dunk, daring the defense to contest. And Towns not known for his rim protection, but he's improved in that area recently, challenging and changing more shots. What is he doing? The ball is not going over there, bro. The ball is going right there. Edwards with the stuff. Well, if you're open, Patrick Beverly is going to do his best to get you the ball. Towns with the steal. Hey! That's good. Driving the lane. 
and it's quickly missing. I think he rushed that one just a little bit, thinking the defense was going to get close. They weren't. I don't know what that was about. I know when that line bleed. Three point range. Oh, this is the kind of start they were hoping for. Pass to Reddish. And he drops in the layup off the glass. How about that? The big man, Mitchell Robinson, able to find a teammate. 15. Minnesota with the ball. Six. They're on a 15 to 6 run. Like, what is he doing? Watch. He's not going to get through this means. Look at him. Look at him. There's a minute left. Look at him. Play in the first. Outside Edwards. Look at him reaching. Shot clock at six. <laughs> and finished off by Edwards. <laughs> Towns down low. His last outing, he had 24 points. He drains it from beyond the arc. Russell's got six points. Their play on both ends has been superb. We, we'll see if they can maintain <laughs> the momentum. <laughs> nah, yo. Known for his rim protection, but he's improved in that area recently. Challenging and changing. Why are you reaching, bro? Jokic, no good. Locked up there for Redwood. Oh, just a soft touch on both ends of that pretty alley. I got to say, when he threw the pass, I didn't know where it was going. To the paint. And McDaniels with the block. And now the Timberwolves on the break. Here's Towns. Good in his goes. If you're going to win on the road, and they simply did not bring it. Edwards can't hit. Well, nice job crashing the glass. You'd love to see that kind of effort. And McDaniels with the block. Russell with it. Now Green defending. And the I don't know what I was doing right there. Anthony Edwards got five. I had like three open shots. I wanted to watch, especially when my team was relevant. It was a couple years where I had no, uh, no desire at all. David Aldridge, you had a chance to talk with head coach Michael Malone. Well, Kevin, he said for them to prepare, What's that? <laughs> barbecue chicken alert! Barbecue point. chicken alert! Close off those driving lanes. They too small. Too, too small, cat. A very long night. And to be honest, it didn't sound like he thought they could. Thank you, David. <laughs> Driving inside. And the shot goes in. Huge hole in the defense that possession. He didn't waste any time. I'm gonna say it live and proud. Whoever's guard this guy, barbecue chicken <laughs> <laughs> yes. can't guard him. Hits the layup after the oh, sweet pump time. fake to freeze the D. Towns has got six. Oh, this is the kind of start they were hoping for. Back to green. Give me that. Stolen by Beverly. Eight second difference between the shot clock and the game clock. Russell with a wide open look. D'Angelo. And again, Minnesota with the triple. Yeah. 